Hi there, in this video we will discuss how to add a formula to a table in Word 2022. Microsoft Word allows you to use simple and easy mathematical formulas in table cells which can be used to add numbers, to find the average of numbers or find the largest or the smallest number in table cells you specify. There is a list of formulas you can use from the formula menu based on the requirement. Here, I have already made the table and done some required formatting. First, we will calculate the total sales for a particular company. So for that, go to the table tools and click on layout. You can see the formula option in the toolbar. Click on that. Here, the default formula is sum. And from here, you can use many other functions like and, average, count, false, if, max, min, mode, not, or product and many more. In Excel, we have to select the sale range. Here, you have to mention the data location like your data is in left side or above or right side or below. Here, we need to calculate the left side of the data. So, right, left and OK. You can see it will total the left side of the data you have put on your table. This is the one way of using formula. You can also write the formula directly by using control function 9 and write the formula is equal to sum bracket open as we our data is in left side so write left and press function 9 see we cannot drag the formula to get the result for every row as we do in excel instead of repeating the same process we can get the result in two ways. The first is press function F4 in every cell to get the desired result. And the second way to get the result is copy the formula of first cell and paste it into the every cell. After that, press function 9. Now we have to total the above data. For that, you have two options. First, go to the formula or else just press control function 9 and write the formula. Sum. As we want to calculate the above data, so write above bracket close and press function 9. It will calculate the above data for you. For calculating the text, you have to randomly type the formula. Before that, you have to check the cell number. Here, if you merge two cells, you have to count it separately. As we want to know the total cells cell number, so just count 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. The cell number for total cells is 13. This is only for the column. If you want to count the row, the row number is 1, 2, that is A and B. So the cell number for total cell is B13. You can type the formula by pressing Ctrl function 9 or click the formula and write the formula here. So let's write the formula Ctrl function 9 equal to B13 multiplied by 10 divided by 100 bracket close and press function 9. Here it will calculate the tax. And to calculate the net amount, we have to subtract the tax from total sales. So for that, press control function 9 is equal to bracket open. The total sales cell number is B13 minus tax cell number is B14 bracket close and press function 9 here you will get the net amount i hope you like the video stay connected for more videos